Hey guys, um, so if you would have gotten in on that bat pattern yesterday that I was telling you about on US Japan, it would have been a 100% winner. You would have gotten cashed out right around the area that I had uh, put. Um, it actually extended even higher, which actually formated a new pattern, which is a cipher pattern. Um, it's actually not correct. It should be around to there. Yeah, so, um, Six. So this is actually another pattern that could happen. Um, I don't know, obviously, if it's going to extend down to actually uh, validate the actual pattern, but we'll see. But that is actually a possible opportunity on USD Japan. USD Chief, let's look at that once more. Well, 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 let's see. Uh, looks like, um, I'm not sure. Actually, Chief USD. I looked at it backwards. Sorry. So if you would have been in the chief USD, you would have also made money right there because it actually perfectly hit that target. And now you see um, the exact same thing that happened. So if you were in any of those trades in yesterday, you would have been profitable. Let's see what the euro is doing today. Oh, the euro's just surfing. It's being a silver surfer today. <laughs> um, Looks like there could be a pattern forming for U.S. Uh, progress. I don't know. So yeah, if this uh, old structure there goes to that, then you could see that. So there's another pattern we could see. So we could see another U.S. run towards uh, the 11350 area. Put it right there because the structure kind of lines up with it. See what odd USD is doing. Oh, I can't see anything. I can't see anything, guys. It's a little bit too hard for me. Uh, it's okay. I don't see anything on the Great Britain USA. Uh, let's see, Euro Great Britain. Yeah, that, I'm clueless. I have no idea what's going on. Um, yeah, those are the things I would look at right now. Um, talk to you guys soon.